गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल दिस इज पार्शविका वेलकम टू अनदर वीडियो ऑफ ग्लोबल आर एम एक्सिन पेज वेर यू मेक कंटेंट फॉर आर दिस इंक्लूडिंग ऑन ट्रिपिन और In today's video, guys, we're going to be talking about the jazzle because yesterday I uploaded a video talking about that mistake. If you're doing it, don't do it. Please check that video out if you haven't checked it so far because you'll be able to know what mistake I'm talking about and how you can improve on that. And also, I did the same mistake, <laughs> so that's why I'm talking about. You can check that video in the card section above, guys. But today I'm going to show you on jazzle what are the different products that are selling and also. how they have made that design specifically for that product and to tell you guys that it's not like any other print on demand website it's different website so we're going to hop on to laptop and see what the products are selling and how we can take an inspiration and idea for our own shop so let's get started with that before going good part consider clicking the like button guys i really appreciate it. and also guys if you want the free resources the free kdp interior free patterns and textures and graphics You can very well check out the various link in the, in the description box below, or you can head over to globalcreative.com and can download the free resources in the freebie section and can use them because it contains a full commercial license. And make sure to check it out each month because we will be adding more each month. Let's hop onto my laptop and yeah, guys. Only we are on the Jazzle. You can see very well now on the very first page itself. If you go, then there are the different products they are talking about that they currently have a thirty percent off on the mugs, beer glasses, water bottles, and more. So you can see these type of products are selling. Like this one is the design by this person. You can very well go onto the shop and check for this designer what they have made for this particular product. And this is the unavailable for the mason jar. So you can see how the each individual product. have been optimized so well that this is for the can this is for the mason jar this is for the bottle and this is for the mug so the if i'm just going to scroll scroll down you're going to see the trend trends on jazzle so if you are making a product or if you're making a designs related to some specific trends then you can very well go to jazzle itself and see what's trending so the celebrate the pride the birthdays are trending the bridal shower gifts the graduation the star wars father day collection because father day is around the corner so that's why it's popular you can even scroll down more and can see the personalized fathers day gifts like this is the card another one the card how they have made the beautifully card now uh, let me just scroll down this is the another invitation then these are the different paper napkins the different products so you can see so you can see this one is the graduation balloon then the graduation card the napkins the mugs the different hangs and all those products are specifically designed for these occasions and yeah so we'll just going to see some of the paper products today that are selling and how they have optimized it for that particular design so let me hover over to the invitation and cards so we'll just going to go over to the wedding invitation first you can see the wedding invitation wedding invitation suit so let me just scroll down now you can very well take a look guys by looking at this particular page you can see that the invitations are coming in various different varieties and apart from that it's very different from the other print on demand platform if you go onto the red bubble if you go onto the other print on demand platform like the t public the cafe press the society six or the spread shirt if any of them are having the card on their uh on their shop you're going to see that their cards are just like a normal card like it's just like a normal design but here you can see the card is not like a print on demand card it's completely different i think you are getting my point what i want to try to say over here like you can see this particular design is optimized or is been made for this particular product only so if you are making your own shop on the jazzle then you need to make a separate design for For each and every individual product to make a good money on the jazzle because people are making six figure and seven figure on the jazzle so make sure you do the same so this way let me just scroll down there are the different colors like you can see and pick up the theme of the cards and can make in the different colors like the terracotta the burgundy the dusty blue the dusty rose purple black and white and so on and so forth then you can also see the different types of formats like the trifold the magnetic the 
photo, the non-photo one, then all in one. Like there are the so many different varieties. At least, guys, you can see that each and every invitation is not like a normal print-on-demand product design. If we go onto the Redbubble and see for the cars, you can see the cars are just like a normal cars. Like you can just putting your sticker design onto the card and that's all. But here you can see the invitations and the, and the products have been specifically designed for that particular thing only so that's what i was trying to say in my previous video if you haven't checked it you can check it out because i was talking over there because if you are taking your jazzle shop as a print on demand shop then you are making a huge mistake guys because the people are using their jazzle shop as a branded shop for specific particular brand and they're creating a brand a business around it like this particular rustic wedding design is specifically made for this wedding invitation only. So that is the unique point about the Jazzle which is not there in any other print on demand platform. Which is pretty amazing guys. You can take an idea from that and you can also make your own shop. Like each and every product is looking so beautiful. It's just next equal to creative market. If you go into the creative market and look for the wedding suits or wedding invitation, you're going to see that there are so many beautiful wedding invitation on the creative market have been designed by the designer the same thing is over here designers only there it's such a digital product people are just purchasing the digital products onto the creative market they're gonna download the wedding invitation and customize it and either gonna take it print out later on but here they can customize it so let me give you how they're gonna customize it if I'm gonna click over to this uh, wedding invitation guys you can see this is a wedding invitation this has been designed by a designer that is a rustic weddings so i can click over to the personalize option and i can personally add this design for my specific own purpose so you can see that the customer can customize and personalize each and every design that they have on the chasm which makes the chasm a unique platform the same is the case of the different like if you go to the creative market and buy the wedding suits as a digital download you are getting the option to customize it either in some software and so on but here you are customizing in the chasm itself the customer don't need to download any separate software to customize these product or to personalize these product so if i'm just going to click over to the personalize and uh, let me see so you can come over here and can write your bride's name the groom's name the date time of the year and can make this template for your specific own wedding or for your own specific occasion so this is the unique thing about the jazzle guys make sure you are utilizing the jazzle very well because this is quite different it's not there in any other print on demand website the people are taking your product as a template they are just not buying your product as a print on demand product they are using your designs as a template and they are customizing and personalizing it for their own use so this is the one example of the invitation now let us look over to the cards so i'm going to go over to the green cards and we'll take a look at the birthday cards and then we will going to compare these birthday cards with the red bubble birthday card to actually show you guys what i'm really talking about so the very first page you can see they have the different kinds of funny disney giant and all different kinds of themes are there so if I'm gonna just pick up any card, let me just pick up any card guys. For example, uh, if I'm gonna pick up this card, it's a funny aging getting old birthday card. Let me just click over here. You can see that this photo, you can replace this photograph of this lady with someone else photograph for which you wanna give this birthday card. If you are giving your granny, your grand mother or grandfather this gift you can very well the, add the picture of your granny over here instead of this picture and can add it so you can do this add it the design option and you can personalize this specific gift so you can see guys now if we have come over here there are the different layers in the jazzle you can create your own layers you can edit the text you can remove this photograph and you can make the changes to this specific card and likewise if i go on to the red bubble and see what their cards look like well i'm gonna type as the cards and we're gonna see the greeting cards on the red bubble and compare it with the jazzle and i'm gonna tell you what's the difference over here so if you're gonna see the different cards on the red bubble now these are the different cards you can't customize these cards guys if customer is landing onto the red bubble they just need 
to purchase these cards they can't personalize it well okay they can't make the changes to this design and you can see the cards have been just made like that only of course the designs are pretty amazing i'm not telling that designs are bad or something like that i'm just telling you the difference between the two platforms and if you are taking a jazzle as a print and demand platform then you are making a mistake i'm just telling you that thing over here so people can't customize it they just need to buy this card and that's all but here you can very well see that i can make changes to whatever i want in this specific card this is just an example of what you can do in the jazzle because jazzle has their own designer software you can see this is a designer software they have i can change this picture i can change this tag i can write the text over here whatever i want like i can write the happy birthday as well like i can do whatever i want to do with this particular card and then i can order it and then i can purchase this card this facility is there in the Jazzle, it's not there in the Redbubble. So that's a big, huge difference. So people are using your product as a template, but in the Redbubble, the people are just purchasing your product as a print-on-demand product. They're just purchasing the card. They are not using it as a template. But in the Jazzle, they are using your product as a template and making changes to that product and then purchasing these print-on-demand product, which is pretty unique about the Jazzle. Now, this is the major difference that I want to talk about. And you can see, you can do with whatever cards you want to do it, guys. You can even make changes to this card. If you don't like this text, you can write your own text and can do whatever you want to do with so that's what the people are doing in the Jazzle and that's what that people are coming onto the platform for the Jazzle. So you need to make sure like whichever platform you are using for your print on demand products, you need to make sure what customer are expecting from that platform when they are landing on that platform, what they have in their mindset while purchasing your product. If they are, pro if they are purchasing your product just as a uh, print on demand product like that only, then it's fine. You can do it whatever way you are doing it on the print on demand. But if they are using your product as a template and they are editing it, personalizing it, making changes it and then purchasing it, and you need to make your design according to it so that the people can customize it people can personalize your card and you're going to make sales if you are making a design in which the people can't make the changes then you are missing out the sale that's what i was doing the mistake in my a previous old shop i was uploading the design but those designs are not customizable because i have just uploading it as a print on demand product only i wasn't uploading as a template for the people to make changes to it that's why i was missing a lot of sales i was making a sales but i was missing a lot of sales because of that one very important factor you need to make your product as a template on the jazzle so that the people can customize it and personalize it and you're gonna make sales not just by selling your print on demand product but also selling your products or designs as a template for other people so that is a big difference guys i hope you find this video helpful i hope i have cleared my point if you have any more doubt do let me know in the comment section below i'll gonna make more video about that so that's it for today video guys i hope you really find it useful and enjoyable i i hope that you really like the today's video leave a comment below and let me know what you think and if you want more such video then don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you so much for tuning in today's video see you for the next time take care bye guys